before you enter the auto show, it's uh, the Jeep Camp, one of the best experiences that you can have there. And for that, we're going to talk to Brad Pinter, who is uh, with Jeep Marketing, talking about Jeep Camp at the Miami Beach Convention Center. Well, um, thank you for having us here at uh, Miami Auto Show. And you have a couple of uh, new things to show uh, people here in Miami. The new Cherokee and then like uh, a pretty good celebration at Jeep Camp, right? Yeah, so we're very proud to, to celebrate the one millionth attendee at the uh, Camp Jeep outside here at the Miami Auto Show. That gives the, um, the ability to showcase the Jeep capability, but also the enthusiasm that you see with the one millionth person coming through. Imagine, 10 years. Oh, it's been 10 years yeah, already? Yeah, 10 years we've been doing it, and one millionth person. But that million uh, uh, person who's going to uh, celebrate here in Miami, that's counting all the other auto shows, because you take that's these correct. everywhere, right? Yes, we do. We take it uh, throughout almost 20 cities every year. So we get about 15,000 at the uh, Miami Auto Show coming through the Jeep um, off-road course. Yeah, and I guess uh, being in Miami, that's uh, <laughs> pretty much the, the highest elevation that we'll get in Miami <laughs> to drive a Jeep because hey, it's pretty flat here. Yeah, so it is, but it shows the capability of Jeep. 18-foot hill that traverses 30 degrees, okay? So that shows the sheer footedness. If it can do it on that hill, traversing the hill, it can do it anywhere, okay? Yeah, absolutely. So it's a great fun for people who have never seen it here in Miami or anywhere else around the country. I highly recommend it. So let's talk a little bit about the Jeep, uh, the Cherokee. The, it's coming out already at the dealerships already on sale? Yeah, in fact, it's just arriving at the dealerships now, and so we're pleased to bring out the 2014 Jeep Cherokee. It's raising the bar in the mid-SUV segment. Yeah, and it's also been, uh, talk a lot about the new design because it's uh, quite different from the other Jeeps, right? Correct. You know, the one thing you have to have is aerodynamics in this uh, market. That's what the customer expects, right? So it comes with 31 miles per gallon, over 500 driving range. And the reason we do that is the aerodynamics, but it also brings forth a brake over um, grill. It retros back to the 74 original Cherokee. So the designers cued in on that, and we're very pleased to bring it back and present it on the 2014 Jeep Cherokee. Yeah, and also new for this one, I understand, is a diesel option is going to be available for this one? Well, this one will be available with two powertrains, an i424 Tiger Shark and a V6, a 3.2 V6, with a nine-speed um, industry-first transmission. But on the diesel, comes out in the Grand Cherokee. Oh, the Grand Cherokee, yeah, the, the big Grand brother. Cher yeah, the big brother, that's <laughs> yeah. what I like to call it. Yeah, but still, I mean, I, this, this uh, the Cherokee, um, it has great capability. I mean, not only on the Jeep Camp, I actually have driven it in a, a pretty serious off-roading, and it's amazing. I mean, because you see, it's, uh, it's this, uh, this version that we're seeing here at the display in the Auto Show is the, the, the trail I rated. But um, even the, the regular one can do a lot of amazing things, oh, right? Oh, definitely, definitely. And that's what we do with the customer. We want to make sure we give them all-weather capability, not just for off-roading, only about... 15% of them actually take them off-road. What we want to make sure that this capability provides safe driving yeah. conditions, okay? So we give you a selection of three 4x4 four four systems to choose from. Uh, yes, the Trailhawk comes with a class exclusive uh, rear locking axle, but the other ones come with sheer footedness also. But what's really unique is we brought in the select train controller from the Grand Cherokee into the Cherokee. That gives you an option to select five modes. Imagine going down the road and selecting through sand and mud different torque capabilities. You can do that manually if you want. Yeah, that's amazing. And some people don't understand that uh, 4x4 uh, technology is not only for off-roading, it's also for a lot of safety, right? Correct. 4x4 gives you sure-footedness on all four wheels, okay? So if you lose traction from one wheel, okay, it transfers that power, that capability, what we call torque management system, to the sh wheels that have the surest grip, okay? And it brings you through that condition safely. So here in Miami, even though we don't have uh, hills or anything like that, it drains a lot. And it drains can be a lot. Slippery. And you can have, very, to your point, very slippery conditions, okay? And what happens when you have the wheel spin through water, okay, it'll transfer that power to the wheels that have the sheer traction capability and guide you through that condition safely. Excellent. Well, thank you very much again for your time, and uh, we'll keep an eye on the one billion uh, rider on the Jeep Camp here outside Miami Convention Center. Thank you for coming. Welcome to the uh, Miami Auto Show. Thank you. Ese fue Brad Printer del de, uh, el equipo de marketing de mercadeo del de, grupo de Jeep, del grupo Christ Autos. Yo soy Javier Mota, esto es Auto 060 y los espero en la próxima edición aquí en Cristina Radio Network.
Este programa fue una producción de National Latino Broadcasting.